My what? <coughs> Harley! I'm really sorry, I didn't mean to spit on you. Who did you just see? No one? That was weird. I thought it was your cousin from from Oh my god. Well done. Your scenes are some of the best in the movie. Thank you. Oh my god, that's awesome. Thank and you. You're in a Meryl Streep movie with so many. Thank you for saying that, because it great is actors. scary to be in the Meryl Streep movie with Alec Baldwin. Yeah, it's it's terrifying to be in a movie with that caliber of actors. They're not only three of the greatest actors we've ever had, but they're specifically three of my favorite actors. So you know, I only worked with Steve for one day, but to be working with Meryl and Alec, and if someone told me that I'd be in a pot smoking scene with Alec and Meryl, I, I would never <laughs> believe them. <laughs> and then, uh, does it help? You know, you, how is it just to be there close to them? Uh, well, I play very nervous in the movie, so it was really easy to play nervous because <laughs> I was nervous every single day. But um, no, they, they were so phenomenally um, good in their performance. I mean, to watch them act, was it was like a, a, a class. It was like you were taking acting class. Um, but then to get to know them and realize um, how amazing it is that they're genuine and sweet people. Uh, I mean, to be that caliber of an actor and not to be removed or, or some way uh, distant is, is amazing to see. I'm from Brazil. Have you ever been there? No, I'm dying to get to Brazil. Mm -hmm. Where would I go if I went? Oh, there's so many options. No, you got to tell me where. Rio, Amazon, uh, Iguazu Falls, the Northeast for beaches. It's yeah? just so beautiful. Amazing. Yeah. Where do you live? Uh, I'm, now I live in Los Angeles, but I'm from Rio. Oh, you are from Rio? Yeah. All right. Rio, and, that's where I'm going. And you know, now they have the World Cup, the Olympics. That's right. Yeah. You guys are stealing all the good things. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, Harles. Harles. Uh -oh. Adam, this is my oldest, Lauren. Hi. And her fiance, <laughs> Harley. Right. We're on a date. <laughs> should also be a little nervous but besides that did you have anything else that was specifically challenging for you um yeah i mean to be in a movie like this it's it's you know it looks so beautiful and the setups take a long time so it's it's the 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 thing is is like when they change the lights or they move to a different shot it's a big deal whereas on the show you know we're we're lit for the same thing all the time mm -hmm. so we don't have long breaks so to maintain you know the idea of i want this joke to work while i want to be funny is hard to do when you've had a long break Mm -hmm. what, what would be the message that you would uh, like people to take, you know, from the, this movie? It's weird, you know, I, I really see this as, a, as, a, um, as uh, an affirmation to uh, um, love, in a way. I think that it's, it's kind of a very sweet love story. I mean, the fact that they're having an affair is, is a difficult scenario, but it, it's, it's one of those things that it proves that when you really love someone, it may be over, but it's not gone. That's great. So thank you very, very Absolutely. much. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Yes. Appreciate it. I would thank like you. to propose a toast to your mother. Out of nowhere, sudden appreciation. Not totally out of nowhere, if you know what I mean. <laughs>